Hey there, my name is George Murray, and I am the son of Dr. Jack Murray, who, along with Dr. Alan McRae, founded Biblical Theological Seminary in Hatfield, Pennsylvania, together with a core group of godly faculty from Faith Theological Seminary. You know, one of Dr. Alan McRae's favorite Bible books was the Old Testament book of Isaiah. And in that God-inspired book, we have two striking statements which seem to contradict each other. In Isaiah 46, 9, God is speaking, and he says, and I quote, Remember the former things. I am God. But then in Isaiah 43, 18, God says, quote, Remember not the former things. Behold, I will do a new thing. So, which are we to do? Are we to remember or are we to not remember? And of course, the answer is both. Many of you will remember how biblical, now Missio Seminary, began in 1971 with God's amazing provision of the Hatfield property, a complete theological library, a competent and experienced faculty, an enthusiastic group of students, and some amazing funding that enabled the seminary to open in record time. And we can remember with thanksgiving all the many wonderful things God has done for Missio in the intervening 49 years. Yes, God tells us in the book of Isaiah to remember the former things because he is God. And those things could only happen because of his wonderful provision and direction. But then God also tells us in Isaiah to remember not the former things because he is doing a new thing. And that certainly describes the current moment in Missio Seminary's history. We have a new name, Missio Seminary, which describes our missional approach to ministry. And we have a new location, the city of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania's largest city and the sixth largest city in America, representing the rapid worldwide movement of people to urban areas. You know, if my father, Jack Murray, were still alive on earth, I think he would be thrilled with Missio's new name and location. Why? Well, first of all, because my dad was first and foremost an evangelist with a missionary heart. He wanted to train seminarians who had a heart to reach the lost, both locally and globally, missional seminarians who knew not only how to interpret God's word, but who also understood the cultural contexts in which they would be ministering. So he would be happy with our new name, Missio Seminary. And secondly, my dad would be extremely supportive of our new location, right in the middle of the city of Philadelphia. Why? Because for many years, my dad, Jack Murray, was the pastor of one of Philadelphia's leading urban churches, Church of the Open Door. And during those 10 years, I saw my father's burden for this great and needy city. He would be thrilled to know that Missio Seminary's vital training program is taking place right in the context of Philadelphia's urban life. Yes, if my dad were still on earth today, I think he would look Missio's president in the eye and say, Dr. Frank James, you have my full blessing as you lead Missio Seminary into the future. Go for it, brother. <laughs>